All right, some big news coming in on IT raids on DMK Mantri. Tamil Nadu uh, Minister Udayanadi Stalin has slammed the IT raids. Stalin warns of legal action. IT raids on a DMK Minister, E.V. Veru, functionary Meena. In fact, uh, this raids has really jolted the DMK government. And you have Udayanadi Stalin, the Chief Minister's son, a minister himself, uh, who is slamming the raids, saying that legal action will follow. IT raids. Pramod Madhav joining us on the phone line. Uh, Pramod, do we have a reaction from uh, Udenidhi Stalin? Has he spoken? He speaks of legal action on the IT raids that's been carried out against his minister. We understand that Absolutely. IT uh, raids have been conducted across premises linked to Velu uh, in his hometown. Tell us what's the suspicion. Absolutely, Nabila. This is the fourth important leader from DMK who has faced IT raids. The first one being Sindhit Balaji. He faced IT and ED raids. And then it was uh, a higher education minister, Pon Moody. And then it was DMK MP Jagat Prachagan. And today it is E.V. Velu, who is also considered as a close confidant and a lieutenant for the uh, Chief Minister MK Stalin. This is where, when we put forward the question, Udinidi Stalin, Minister for Sports for the State, who went to Congress office to get a senior leader's signature on need, he went ahead and said that there are several wings in DMK and Congress, like uh, Students Wing and Youth Wing. In such way, BJP seems to be having ED as a wing and IT as a wing, and they have been performing uh, great in the past couple of months. And he also said that uh, the party and uh, EV Velo will face these uh, charges legally. All right. Uh, well, uh, do give us a sense on the uh, the, the importance of uh, Velu, Minister Velu, in the DMK uh, cabinet. Uh, we believe, uh, you, like you said, he is one one of the most important ministers, a fourth uh, in command, rather. Uh, IT sleuths conducting raids on his premises uh, has really jolted the DMK with Udayanidhi Stalin saying, or, or rather threatening, that they're going to take legal action. On what grounds does he say that? Well, Nabila, the thing is that, like, when it comes to Chief Minister Stalin, there are a certain kind of old guard who, uh, who surround him all the time. It'll be uh, Dure Murugan, the senior leader. Then we also have uh, uh, T.R. Balu, who is the voice of DMK in uh, Delhi. And also we have uh, uh, the E.B. Belu, Ponmudi, and such leaders. And this is where several IT raids have occurred. Like, only Jagat Rajagan is also one of them. And all, uh, like, three, except for T.R. Balu, others have faced this IT raid. And this is where DMK has come forward and said this. Not just that, uh, DMK also has uh, mentioned that this is nothing but intimidation tactics. In fact, the chief minister, while speaking on these matters, uh, like two days back, also like uh, mentioning the phone hacking, he said that BJP is trying to uh, uh, use intimidation tactics. That is one is ED rate, the other one is IT rate. And now they also started phone hacking. And that way, DMK claims that all such uh, IT rates are nothing but a way to intimidate and break the Indy alliance, Sabila. Okay, to break the India alliance. Now, that's uh, uh, a statement that Udari Di Shalhan makes, uh, far-fetched from, from the looks of it, considering uh, Velu is suspected um, of uh, the IT ministry. It seems like uh, clearly the IT uh, department, as we know, has uh, raided him based on some kind of suspicion of corruption. So uh, linking it to the India block, that trying to cripple the India block is certainly far-fetched. But let's see what the IT department really finds of these raids. There's 40 locations across Tamil Nadu has been raided. Uh, Velu currently under the dock, in the dock.